forgot guys, hi, it's the countryside, well not countryside, but it's the foresty walking day today, so, oh my god, okay, so, I am the least prepared for this because, one, I haven't even put the cookies in the oven yet, and I thought, and it's like, something like 11 o'clock now in the morning, and I thought I'd have everything done, like, I literally thought I'd be leaving by now, but I'm not even out of bed yet, like, I still need to go in the shower, I still need to cook the cookies, so I need to pack the picnic bag, so um, I am the least prepared for all it, but um, yeah, but I actually kind of overslept, well I didn't say I was asleep, but I woke up at like 8 o'clock when my alarm went off, and then um, I had a short nap after that, so, like something like 10 minutes, and then I just kept like napping in a way, like until like now, so um, yeah, maybe it's because I did go to sleep at like 3am, but yeah, I probably should have thought of that before decided to stay awake till 3am to get stuff done but anyway so I'm gonna put some stuff in the oven now and then we're gonna go in the shower get myself ready and then we should be good to go What else should I make? Like, I'm making cookies right now, but I don't really want to make sandwiches, that's the thing. Because I actually don't like sandwiches, so I'm gonna have a look, but maybe cookies might be an option. Because I'm, I'm not really a huge eater anyway when, anyway, anyway, uh, anyway when I'm outside, so um, yeah, and I don't need to make drinks either because uh, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna get a coffee when I go to Costa in the middle of another minute, so don't need to think about that, but um, yeah, I think that's about it really. Um, everything else I'm gonna get elsewhere. So yeah, I'm also thinking as well of going to the range right now and getting like a picnic kind of blanket. So I think I might do that. So I'm finally packed. I've got all the things on. So I've got this like bag full of picnic stuff. So I'm very excited. So first of all, I need to go to all these a few things. Um, I'm not sure when I'll be back because today's Sunday and the shop's short on Sunday so I'm going to go to Aldi to get a few things um, but yeah, today's a very exciting day. Okay, yay, I'm out. First of all, the first stop here is going to the range because I need to look at a few things so I might try and look for a picnic, like blanket thing as well, I don't know but okay, so this is like just turning into a like, key thing of me just looking around for no reason. I'm not going to buy anything really, but I have looked like really interesting baking stuff, so, and I love baking, so, um, I guess that's kind of good, but, um, yeah, I'm just looking around all the camping stuff and things like that, um, it makes me really want to, like, plan, like, a solo holiday for myself, like, I would really, like, love to do what some YouTubers do, like, do, like, solo holidays and all that, well, not some YouTube, like, ev you know, most people do it, but, um, I'd love to do that at some point this year, so, yeah. Okay, so, I'm out on the road now. Well, not on the road, but I'm on the path, but I'm, I'm really excited because I love walking and all that, but, oh my god, my legs are so itchy. Like, you know when you get, get, get like, an itch when you're outside and you're wearing, like, sports pants or whatever, and you have, like, really itchy legs, which, like, won't stop itching, no matter how hard you scratch. I'm currently feeling that right now, and it really is annoying, but, oh well. But right now, I am... Um, on a path which I don't know where it leads to. Okay, can I just say also, I've not planned this entire route out, like, I know where I'm going, but I just haven't planned the route on how to get there, so this is going to be very interesting, trying to find my way to get to this place without, like, a map or route or anything like that, so, um, yeah, but luckily I kind of know where I'm going, so, um, yeah. Okay, so I've come across this big field, oh my god, this field's massive, oh my god, okay, I've never known a field so big in my life in 
the UK, normally when there's like a big like open field or anywhere like in the UK, like if it's not farmland then they'll normally just like build houses, that's how the UK works. So it's quite surprising to see a massive field from here, like hello main character moment. Yeah I'm just really excited to be on a field for some reason. Okay, so I've just walked through that yellow field thing and for some reason it's kind of giving me a headache which um, we'll probably do because I literally walked straight through the yellow flower thing and yeah, so um, yeah, I'm now walking across this like farmland thing. Yeah, this walk's actually been quite good up to now, like I loved it, like it's good to get out of the house and get some fresh air, so now I need to try and find someone to have a picnic. So I try and pick like a cute and quirky place to have a picnic, like, or should I just wait till like picnic bench comes up or something, I'm not sure but yeah. Right, okay, so just ran into a problem. I think I may have like took the wrong direction and walked like all the way down this path just for it to be a dead end and end at like a farmhouse. I'm hoping there's a way through this because I like walked all the way to up to here only to like find out it's a dead end so I have to walk all the way back but hopefully there should be a way through but who knows. Okay, time for the moment of truth. Well, there isn't. Now I'm gonna have to like, walk all the way back to like, where I came from, that intersection bit, and walk another way. Very sad indeed. Okay, so after much trying to find um, ways to turn around and try and find ways which aren't dead ends and things like that, I finally managed to get to a woods with paths, so this is definitely a woods which you can get through. So I'm actually really excited because I actually love woods so much. Like, um, I honestly like it's like a mystery kind of thing, like it's like a thing where you just never know where it leads to so I'm gonna pretend that it's the case for the entire duration that I'm in the woods. So here we have this curved path full of mud which I probably should have realised when I decided to wear these grey trainers. I walk through the mud hoping that my grey trainers will get ruined and then walk down this straight path. Well not so straight but you know what I mean. You walk gracefully down this path until you reach this bend and who knows what might be coming. And here you see all the aesthetic leaves, all the nice leaves that we have around here. Looking very good indeed. We are now approaching the bend. Who knows what could be in front of us? We'll wonder what to take. Take a right or take a left. So according to the map, we need to take a left down this path. As we approach deeper into the woods, we approach more nettles and more things coming in our way. Who knows? We have to try and find the right way to look, walk through this thing without being hurt. Can we get through here? Yes, we can. And yes, no injuries were sustained during that period. But there is a mud thing here though, RIP these trainers. As he tries to walk through the mud without ruining his trainers, he does it successfully. And then we approach more things coming our way. We have this dead end. Shall I walk through it? Oh, not as it seems. We take a right instead. Ah, there we go. Two minutes later, and we approach this lovely tree section of the woods. Look at this lovely tree and some lovely barky paths. We stroll along through this woods and luckily we see some houses so we can't be that isolated in the woods which is a good sign. So we are just going to continue to stroll gracefully through the woods. And now we approach onto an even bigger path. 
Very exciting indeed. And now we are finally out the woods. I don't know why I decided to do that voice, but um, yeah, I always liked watching that um, little clip of the video. Um, but yeah, I'm out the woods now. So I honestly never thought I'd get out of that woods though, because it's so big and so like has so like dead ends. So like it, was, it took ages for it to like get through. Okay, so now I'm on the like, open path thing. So I feel like I found like, a big thing. Oh my god, okay, so I know this place now, so I remember years ago I took a photo on this like mountain bit here where the tree is, the tree is on top of the, I took a photo and it was like really bad, but I wish I could find it because it was like really bad I wanted to show you guys, but I think I was like doing like, you know when YouTubers like, or any other people like take photos and they're like holding knees and stuff, like I took that and it honestly like, it was bad. I'm gonna try and recreate it for you guys. So I tried to go on top of the mountain, but that didn't happen because I just like slipped off. So I ended up having to take a photo like on the ground here. Now I think it was something like this, so ow, it hurts. So I went on the ground like that, and then I just like went like this kind of, but it was like really awkward. So it's kind of like this. So you can tell like how people normally like use the knees and stuff to take photos. I did it like this, but I think I did, I did something like this. And it's like really awkward, so I then tried to get another photo of me on my knees on the mountain, but that was a fail. Okay, so I'm gonna try and go up this mountain again. So last time I did this, like I think it's something like a long time ago, I kind of like slid off, like I literally fell, and it really hurt me as well. Like I think I like scraped my knee or something. Like it kind of freaking hurts, but I'm gonna try and go up this time. Okay, right, I'm walking up. Why is it like okay? Why am I doing it? Like I'm literally halfway up here. <laughs> can I get up my arms? I don't think I can. Right, I don't think I should because how am I going to get down otherwise? Well, this is how far I went, so... Um, yeah, I managed to get sort of halfway up here. And when I got this far up last time, like I fell and slipped, so... An achievement, to say the least. So now how am I going to get down? Oh, I, I literally nearly fell then. <laughs> okay. I'm down. Anyway, it's time to... Try and find a way out of here. Okay, so 10 minutes later, I found the bench and I'm gonna eat the picnic foods right now, so yeah. Okay, so I've had to like balance my phone, which I'm using as a camera, on a tripod on top of my backpack, so hopefully it won't drop. But I got the picnic stuff, so I've got an apple in there, got a, well, I've got the things for the camera, my phone camera, which is like the fish island and stuff, but I'm stuff in there so they get lost. But then I got some cookies as well, which are a bit burnt, because I, to, I accidentally like, burnt them a bit when I was cooking morning because I've got like a million other things to do. So I burnt them a bit but it still tastes nice. So I'm gonna eat a cookie right now. <laughs> These were the cookies that I forgot to add eggs in and it actually tastes much nicer without eggs I will say. So I don't know guys, I think I might try an eggless cookie mix next time. So well not a cookie mix but my own cookie recipe because I make my own cookie dough because you know. But yeah, this tastes really nice. Very crispy, but also very nice as well. Two hours later. Okay, so I haven't vlogged since I had that picnic. So much has happened during there. Like, I've literally just, like, what? Well, I'm on my way home now, so, um, that's one thing. And also, the blue sky's out. Like, it's really fucking hot now. Like, I've literally had to, like, take my, like, sweat jacket off because it's, like, become so hot out. So, it's actually quite nice and pleasant now, so. Okay, I'm home now, and oh my god, it is so hot out, like, it's just gone from, like, being cloudy to, like, just being boiling hot, like, oh my days. Yeah, I think the time is calling now for a good old coffee, um, and I might sit outside for a bit because it's, like, boiling out. Okay, so I'm currently making bread right now because there's no bread in, and the store's closed now because it's Sunday, and normally stores close at 4 on Sunday, and, and I came back at, like, around about four-ish, so I didn't really have time to go to the store to get bread and stuff, but not to worry because I can bake my own bread, so yeah. I haven't made bread in years, so this is going to be quite a first. Got my very own mixer. Okay, well the bread making process got disrupted because I just opened the oven to let the nachos out because we were done, and I think I might have burnt the nachos a bit to the point where like, when I took the nachos out of the oven, like, I opened the oven door and the smoke was, like, billowing out the oven, like, I know you can't really see it, but it is quite smoky in here, but here's what nachos look like, so, 
They are burnt. Guys, I don't know what's with me today in burning stuff. Like, I've burnt cookies this morning, and now I've burnt these nachos, so... I don't know what's with me today, but am I, am I just all of a sudden become a rubbish cook? Like, what is going on? Anyway, gotta take these nachos out. <laughs> Look at that. Burnt to a crisp. Well, not burnt to a crisp, in fact. I think it's better for me to say I actually like burnt nachos. I know that sounds bad, but um, I actually like, like, anything like carbohydrates kind of burnt to a light. Um, I used to like burnt toast, I used to like burnt chips, all the things, so this is my forte. Anyway, so now time to resume the bread making. Okay, so for some reason I didn't film the outro for this video, so um, let's just say the bread went really well, and um, you'll see that on the next vlog, um, and yeah, there's nothing really much to really add on to the vlog. Yes, this video clip's like really laggy and really little quality because I'm filming this on my laptop camera. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'll um, see you guys in another vlog or wherever you see me. I'm gonna leave you guys right now. Let's go, let's go. I don't know, so bye.